Hello everybody, Ultimate G-Man here, once again, to give you guys my review of One Piece, chapter 823, holy crap, this chapter, this chapter was really, really good, we got a lot of exposition, a lot of details, more about the kingdoms and their involvement with the world government, and how now, due to this, that's the reason why Vivi was introduced in the last chapter, and that's the reason why we're going to be dealing with Vivi a lot, is because in this new chapter... We, we figure out that there is going to be a meeting of the kings. All the kings are going to meet together, and this is very important. And then we get more details about the different, the different you know, dictatorships that are, or monarchies that are going to be coming. Like, we get um, the mermaid lady and underground, un, uh, with, with the whole underwater, their kingdom, you know, with Poseidon and everything. We get um, Drum City... With Wapole, Wapole is coming, he's going to have to be in the meeting. Then we got Cobra and Vivi and them from Alabasta. And we also get Rebecca and all of them from Dressrosa. And all these different people are going to be coming and coming to this meeting. And also the people, it was really, really weird. We got some bit from Rogue Town. And that is weird. The, 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 the dictatorship at Rogue Town? We're going to get involvement with that? Hmm. That's going to be interesting. So we get more details about that. Uh, not a lot happened in this chapter. Honestly, if I were to really, like, say, it was more like just we're, we're getting in, we're all these, we're getting introduced to the New Kingdom thing. And it's kind of interesting because um, I was just reading the Alabasta part in the manga yesterday. I was just beginning at Alabasta and I, and I, like, passed by the part where they did the meeting and everything, and they were talking about Monkey D. Dragon. This is probably going to parallel that because of what happened later on in this chapter, which I'm not going to get to yet. I'm going to talk about that later. But, yeah, we see all these, we see all the different kingdoms coming together, and they're all going to meet about something. What are they going to meet about? Current political events, and I really think they're going to talk about Dragon because... What we learn at the end of this chapter is that the island was destroyed. An island was destroyed. And we're talking the island that the revolutionary army, revolutionary army was on was freaking destroyed. And that has to do with Blackbeard. Marshall D. Teach. Marshall D. Teach. Kuro Hige. Marshall D. Teach. Kuro, Kuro Hige. We get him. And we, like, this is so much set up. And I just can't wait to see what's going to happen. And we learn about this detail, like, and, like, we figure out that Kara is going on the crew with them. She's going on the mission with them to go and deal with Big Mom. And we learn more about that. And then we have Nami and, and whatnot. They're all going on this crew. And we get more, like, character moments with them. And, you know, Carrot being, like, a rabid. Like, oh, I'm bringing my carrots and everything. And, like... Yeah, like, this chapter wasn't really, like, blowing my mind, but it was necessary. It felt like this chapter wasn't, like, super-duper fast, super-duper quick space, the best chapter ever, but it was necessary, and it was, like, a lot of different reveals about a lot of the different people, like, a lot, the, a lot of the, what everyone else is doing right now, learning more about Vivi, and we see that Vivi... Her character is still, she still has effects from that time with them in Alabasta. And she has still, has like, you know, that pirate, you know, spirit and everything. And she's like, yeah, I'm still, I'm still a straw hat, even though I'm not a straw hat anymore. Even though I'm not with the straw hats. And you can see her character, you know, I just, we just love Vivi, okay? We just love Vivi. And Karu, Karu the duck. If in this next arc, we get to see Vivi and freaking Karu. With the straw hats? Oh my god. So yeah. Chapter just setting up so much stuff. It's just setting up everything. So yeah. Not much happened in this chapter once again. I would give this chapter, if I were to rate it out of 10, I would give it a solid 7 to 8 out of 8 and a half out of 10. I wouldn't really, I mean, 8 and a half to a 9. <laughs> I can go, keep going up because I love One Piece. Every, I mean... One Piece, you know, freaking awesome, pretty much. It's my best shonen if 
Hunter x Hunter wasn't like on hiatus all the time. Speaking of Hunter x Hunter, I did a video talking about the new chapter that came out. For those of you who do not know, Hunter x Hunter has returned. Hunter x Hunter! Hunter! Well, I know the opening. Well, yeah. Anyway, what are y'all thoughts on this chapter? What do you think happened to um, the headquarters, the revolutionary headquarters? What do you think happened? Anyway, give me your thoughts. Like and write your thoughts in the comment section below. And peace out.